Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to this let's play. If you remember from last time, we've got one more tomb to find, and I'm hoping it's right down in this corner. I'm trying to think of anywhere else I didn't explore thoroughly. More Incablosa troops. Did I head right into that corner? Headed right into that corner. I remember I went into here, up there, down there, then out there. Oh, my archers, my archers, my archers! Oh, yes, we found the last one. Brilliant! We need to heal really soon, though. My archers are taking it. Or is that just the end of the level? Avoid direct combat with enemies and protect the bone dragon. Or it can withstand only so much damage. Move out. Return from whence you came, mortal. Alright, so now we need to run. Oh, the bone dragon! The bone dragon! Bone dragon under attack! Time to run! I go to hell for last time. Right, so I've got my bone dragon. Retreat, retreat. Run. Run. Cavalry will be good at this. Now the bone dragon's attacking them. Run quickly! Rock mortals, go! Got tangled up in the run! Now! Yes, master! Sneak her first on the run! Go! Got tangled up, run! Run quickly! Run quickly! I go to help, Ryder! Master says move! <sighs> I've got my lovely bone dragon. Looks like it has lots of ranged damage. Brilliant, I can get a healing tree off here. Heal everyone up. Everyone just run, everyone just run! Run away! I go to hell for last time. It was there I needed to get to, right? Yeah, it's the only place left. Elf archers, hit. Right, good, we're just getting followed. So we can see we're ahead of them. We're getting followed though. At least we're faster. Are they faster? We're nearly all there. We head for Kalashir. Quickly. <sighs> the level's capped. So if I wanted to maximise the amount of experience I got, I should have got the Bone Dragon enough kills to cap the ex... Uh, game on. I was getting excited over all the experience I was going to get from that. Time to run away! I wonder how powerful the Bone Dragon is and if I should spend all my points on upgrading it or... We'll see. The humans are here, Lord. Well done, Leinhardt. Bring me their leader. Let's get to the point, shall we? What do you want? To die in this world as a normal man. You? Normal? Did not the half-elf explain this to you? Not specifically. Because the humans destroyed the ancient heart, the Age of Darkness has begun. If Enkoblosa is not destroyed, everything in the Age of Light will vanish. Enkoblosa? That 
abomination in the sky? Aye. The world repeats the ages of light and darkness. The Lord of Light is Nibel, and Enkoblosa rules the darkness. But till now, we lived in the Age of Light. But the humans have destroyed Nibel's ancient heart, so Nibel has gone to sleep, awakening Enkoblosa. Enkoblosa will plunge the world into darkness. You're a liar. I know that Enkoblosa is a god worshipped by the bloody swines. If Enkoblosa is awake, it'll be a world made for the heretics. You wouldn't want to stop it. As you may have noticed, Enkoblosa cares neither for humans nor for us. It wants only to transform all things into those suitable for the Age of Darkness. The orcs only worshipped it because they were deceived by the Lich Kiliani. And while deceiving orcs is no great challenge, even Moonlight and I could not fathom Kiliani's plans, though Kiliani eventually incurred Nibel's wrath. Nibel? As you yourself have seen in Noart, Inkoblosa sucks in everything around it and spawns life forms suitable to its Age of Darkness. The Dark Curtain will spread to cover the entire world. Then monsters will fill the world, and a new evolution will begin. How do you know all this? During the Second War of Heroes, the great and evil Kiliani opened the dimensional door using the Ancient Heart, and many soldiers, including myself, were pulled into Engoblosa. I returned only through a mysterious tower where we shared its knowledge. The more I hear, the less I'm inclined to believe. Tell me this. How are you still alive when the ancient heart is destroyed? I will slowly become mortal. I have not much time left. And how do you propose we destroy Enkoblosa? Enkoblosa awoke because Nibel's ancient heart was destroyed. If we destroy Enkoblosa's ancient heart, Nibel will come alive and bring back the Age of Light. Destroy Inkablosa's ancient heart? I'll ask again. How? As I said, the inside of Inkablosa's body is connected to another dimension. If we venture there, we shall find its ancient heart. Go into that monster's body? Specifically, into another dimension. You must send some mages inside Inkablosa in your battaloon and have the soldiers wait outside with us. Have the mages summon the soldiers and thus inside the body of Engoblosa. We will have to walk from there to find a heart. We will first drill a hole on Engoblosa's outer skin with a bone dragon. Can we come back after entering its body? The mysterious tower I mentioned? We can return to the real world only through that tower. That sounds ridiculous, but... I see no reason to fight the monsters again tonight, and wait until tomorrow. If you agree, we should act now. If you agree that from the time we enter the hole in Inkablosa's skin, to when we reach our destination, you will follow our lead. I almost forgot how humans value the illusion of control. It is of no importance. As you wish. Right. Oh, I don't actually get to control the Bone Dragon, so it's not one of my troops, but I do have lots of experience to go. So, let's see. Should level that up. Mm, that's expensive. That's only the only time he's going to get that. It's nice and cheap. Should help. I'm not gonna get me here up. We'll save that. I 
that's fine as is. What troops am I even going to get to bring? Get them all up. Slightly increases defense, attack power of the beasts. Reduces second greatly increases attack of lists and slightly. Tell me if I go to the main gate, right, what I need in the next level, won't it? So if we go to it, it'll say, blah blah de blah de blah units. Four, three, and two support. So, archers. If you are... So we're definitely going to... Rainier. Cavalry. Archers. And the ghouls to tank. And then these two units of support. I'll just get that to 20. That to 20. And use that to then maybe get this guy up. As ready as we'll ever be. If you are ready. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm worried about this level. I'm worried, I'm worried, I'm worried, I'm worried, I'm worried. Make an extra save just in case I've got the two saves from when I started again. If I need to go back and respend that experience, stand by the teleportation area until the battle is arrived. Oh, I don't have a choice, I've got to do that one. Right, for this one, we will do the Swamp Mammoth then. And the Ghouls. Right, let's start. Let's start! Follow me. Ooh. Let's get moving! Spitters right off the gut, bad, that's not bad. Right, eh. Uh, Swamp Mammoth, you're not gonna stop, you're just gonna keep on walking, because you take forever to walk. Right, let's take care of these spitters. I'm guessing there's gonna be a lot of spitters constantly going after my. S. Bone Dragon, so it'll be great to have three units of melee troops just to keep them occupied. There's no more enemies appearing yet. And that Swamp Mammoth is still moving, right? Yeah, I see it walking, I see it walking. I see the Swamp ma Mammoth. Another tree down. What's this here? Think of the splitters. The undead are doing retreat. What are these? More splitters. Lots of splitters. Master says move. Go spreading oaths. Let us get it done and done. 
More spares! Yep, yep, yep. What a surprise. Okay, this is gonna be a problem. I need the raiders to start generating me. Yeah, I need these guys to die! Master does say move. The ghouls are in trouble. Get okay, a tree over here. Swamp Mammoth attacking to there. Okay. This is not doing well. I thought this US Spurs would have been dead by now. One bone dragon attack then. There's one mammoth attacking there. You still count as being in melee? Oops. Right, come on, archers, I need your healing. Stop being counted as being in combat. Come on! Oh no, I've lost a ghoul. Oh, that's not fair. Come on, quickly, get it down before they lose another ghoul! There we go. Get in here to heal, get in here to heal. And we can head back and get these spitters. Healing spell in there. Hey, we're doing good, especially now that the swamp mammoths dumping DPS down upon them. That you do, that you do. And let's get rid of these spares. Where are these enemies? No, Swamp Mammoth actually keeps stomping along. You take forever. Actually, everything can start moving on over now. We're full held. Swamp Mammoth, be so slow! The Swamp Mammoth shoot and move at the same time, though. I don't know. Bone Dragon, get back! Archers, take out the Inca Flyer quickly! Swamp Mammoth, don't stop walking! Why are the ghouls all the way back there? Oh, attack, don't... Yeah, can get a tree in there. And Swamp Mammoth, stomp right on through, if you would, please. Good, 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 good. Your orders, they are the living that you ain't so... Good old Swamp Mammoth, keep on walking right through the middle of them. 
What are you just doing in melee archers? Again! Run! Quickly! Run! Every time I want to get a damn healing spell off. Bone Dragon, move to this side where you're a bit safer. Run! Quickly! Come on, you're miles away from the combat. Come on, hurry up and get that healing spell off! Hurry up! Bone Dragon is shooting, right? Where's the Swamp Mammoth? Tell it to stomp on through. Keep on stomping! That's your job, is to stomp! Bone Dragon Archers will deal the damage. Archers, why is not firing? Right. We're pushing. We've got a lot of pushing to do still, though. Turn from whence you came, mortal. Keep that healing tree up. Death to the enemy! Getting our healing tree up was a max. Return from whence you came, Oh, the Bone Dragon stopped attacking. Swamp Mammoth, don't stop moving. Right, nearly got them all. Nearly got them all. Return from whence you came, Marco. One unit left. One unit left. Oh, there's one behind me. Right. Where's all the other enemies? I see my mammoth trying to walk through. Let's get everything moving then. Okay. I think we've got one more bend to get through up here, and then that's us there. Get them engaged before they start attacking my bone dragon. Get a tree off there, the ASAP. I remember doing this level as the humans. They had to do this exact same level with but with their balloons. Try and get a meteor off quickly. Try and get a meteor off. Not the archers have been engaged in melee. Get out. Swamp Mammoth, get up here. How are you still in melee? You are so far away. Right, get a tree off now. Tree off now. Now. Good, they got that tree off. Master does say move. Master, 
Nice work, cavalry. Okay, that healing tree off. Mammoth get moving. If the cavalry spamming me points, I can use my healing stuff and those close combat stuff all the time. Cutting through them fast now. Death to the enemy! I'm here to obey. Right, Swamp Mammoth, keep on walking, because you take forever. And these are guys are nearly dead. Right, one unit left. There's one of them there. I hope there's one here. Two of them here. Not that many of them. Up goes the weasel. Oh hello, we've got a new load of them on the way. Archers are blocked by trees, so oh, that's just annoying. And what range to have on me here? I wish we had a slightly bigger range. I don't want to cast it on my own men, that will hurt. All spitters, they really don't want this dragon getting out. Though, with the Swamp Mammoth actually engaging because it's head, not having to walk, it deal lots of damage, so. Yeah, these I mean, spitters been torn to shreds. We're nearly there now. Nearly there. Cavalry doing lots of damage too. So let's use my special thing. Who's the cavalry? Cavalry! I need just to do some raiding. Cavalry are micro intensive, but they're the best unit farming SP. Royal, 
More of them? Oh, come on! I thought we were going to get to move in a second. The bone dragon's still fighting, right? Get that heal off! Yeah, there's a lot of them just coming in. Thank you.